and action. And today on Matt and M, we're going to talk about sober celebration ideas for New Year's Eve. So don't forget to hit like and subscribe and let's get started. Um, yes, I'm in my pajamas already. It's late, right? What time is it? Like seven? It's bedtime. It's like five. So sober celebration ideas. New Year's Eve is traditionally, at least in America, a pretty uh, alcohol-related uh, evening. And so sometimes when people are trying to get sober or they have a lot of sobriety, they struggle to find creative ideas of how to have fun and celebrate the ending of a year and beginning of a new year in the absence of that staple. So we decided we would come up with a super cool list of things to do. My first one was host a game night. I hate board games, but I got this really cool Unstable Unicorns game, and it's not a board game. It's it's a it's a card game, and it says you can build a unicorn army, a unicorn army, betray your friends, and then unicorns are your friends now. So guess what we'll be playing tomorrow night? We'll be playing Emmy's Unicorn Army. Yeah, but God. What's another one, babe? Um, I'm going to skip to uh, my personal favorite. Okay, what's your personal what favorite? we're actually going to be doing tomorrow. What's that? Uh, movie Marathon. Ah, oh, what movies are we going to... I hate watching movies. Yeah. My attention span... What do you say about me? He says my... Uh, I'm like an overexcited five-year-old on Christmas Eve every night, every day of my life. And I am. And overexcited five-year-olds don't like to watch movies, especially marathons of movies. It's a lot of paying attention. What movie? I don't know. If it takes like three or four days just to find a movie to watch, much less uh, well, we know marathon. New Year's Eve is tomorrow. And I did not know that, actually. Do you know what day it is, Maddie? Oh, poor Matthew. It's nighttime. That's the day. I know. Oh, you poor thing. Okay. So another idea is a city-sponsored event. So I'm originally from Massachusetts, and Massachusetts really, like Boston, would have um, first night, it's called. And so you could go in town. We could all take the train, and they had fireworks, and it was pretty festive. Freezing, but festive. Um, so that's another thing that you can do. I don't know of anything around here. Do you? Like any kind of city thing? No, no, I don't. Hmm. I can't even think of anything. You pretty much are on your own. Yeah, so maybe we should work on that, getting some city stuff to do. What's another one? I mean, you led with your favorite. Do you have any second favorites? Well, fancy dinners are, are special. Oh, I do like fancy dinners. Yeah. Like the, one of those restaurant five-course meal. You get to dress up all beautiful and sequins and stuff and see here's uh, the fundamental difference between her and i special fancy dinners for her are dressing up real nice and this and that's great i love doing that too but i was thinking about the two of us spending a lot of time together in the kitchen cooking because i'm you know the hopeless romantic and helpless you've seen me cook right Maybe you can chop vegetables while I cook. Oh my gosh. Don't let's not do that one. Um hmm. Here's one I would like. Having a hosting a New Year's Eve party. You think it's too late for us to do that? You think it's too late to have a party? I think we should have a party. Everybody can dress up fancy and we'll bring in the New Year together. What do you think? The house is clean. We clean the house so much today. It's ready for a party. You want to do that? Let's have a party. Okay. Oh, wait, I got a better idea. Let's volunteer. We should volunteer somewhere. Okay, that's another idea of volunteering. Yeah. Where that, do you want to volunteer? A, I don't know wherever there's not a party. <laughs> I love you. Uh, our final... Our final one is um, creating a vision board or coming up with your goals for the year. I really like to do that on the first day. I like to do like a first day hike and then do vision boards. I usually wait for Christina. And Christina is amazing at vision boards. 
she has such a cool track record for accomplishing our goals. So I really like to make my vision board near her because I feel like she's got some super Pisces power luck about that. It's not really luck. She's very driven and hardworking. Um, but so we could start our vision boards. Are you going to make a vision board this year? Mm, no. How about set goals? Set goals? I set goals every year. What You do? Yeah. Do you tell your wife about them? No. Why? Because then they don't come true. It's not wishes, Matthew. It's goals. It's different. No, not in my boat. You're about the same thing. You, no. Maddie's not having a great day. Can you tell? Let's cheer Maddie up in the in the comments. He's having a, a bad day. How, how do you want people to cheer you up? I know. We can watch a Rush concert. Send money. That'll, that'll cheer me oh up. Oh, my gosh. I'm kidding. Stop. I'm kidding. <laughs> okay, so sober celebrations. It is possible to have fun on New Year's Eve without drinking or getting drunk. And, and, you know, it's really kind of a silly habit we had anyways because who wants to start their whole new year hungover and feeling bad? So let's try to do this one sober and we can do a bunch of different ideas. We can play games. We can watch movies. We can cook special dinner together. We can set goals. Um, we can volunteer. Actually, I feel like we can do most of those things tomorrow to entertain ourselves as, as we close out one year and, and reflect on all the things that we were able to accomplish and highlight the things that we want to continue to work on or maybe new things that we want to work on going into the, the next year, 2024. So don't forget to like and subscribe and check us out in 2024. We're actually working on a calendar. We've been working on a calendar of content to try to, um, I don't know. I don't like that idea because then it's like. No, it's a great idea, but I, don't, I just don't think it's happening. I'm more impulsive than that. It's like I want to decide what I'm going to record on right as I'm recording. 30, 30 seconds before we record. Yeah, why not? Then it's not scripted. We just chat. We just chat with each other. It's perfect. Happy New Year, everybody. Yeah, and if you come up with any ideas about how we how others can spend uh, New Year's Eve or uh, days like that, let us know in the comments uh, if you have any other ideas. I mean, having a game night kind of sounds fun, but then it kind of doesn't. So, but if you can add to the list and uh, inspire us to try some new things, we'd appreciate that. Maybe maybe we'll shave my beard tomorrow. Maybe we'll have a party and I'll and I'll send you clips of the I'll post clips of the party. I've, I've got, we're gonna have a great video tomorrow. It's gonna be hilarious. Why? What do you got planned? What are you gonna do? I don't have anything. Are you planned. gonna punk me? I punk you. Yeah. Who do you think I am? I don't know, Matthew Ross. Yeah. All right.